There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, divas? What's up, divos? What's up, everybody? What's up? So, y'all, listen. It is gloomy out here. It's about to be a storm. I'm excited. I like when it's cloudy days, okay? But I hope y'all are having, like, a really great day. It's Saturday, you know. I'm about to push out all these videos in one day. Well, it's only three. Girl, listen. I've never tried this company. Not that I can remember, but because my memory be short-lived at times. But they're called My Crown Wigs or My Crown Hair. Girl, I will definitely link everything down below. Now, they sent me this really nice lace front wig. When I say it's really nice, meaning the lace looks very promising, honey. When something looks promising, that's when you have high hope, girl, you be all in. You like, okay, I'm, I, this is gonna come through for you, girl. It's gonna all work out. So I did have to bleach the knots of the unit. So like I said, the lace was nice, but girl, it did not come bleach, bleach, bleach like that, okay? But I did put in some work. So it was like a little bit bleached, but you know, I had to go back in because the knots was on like trimester two. So girl, yes, you know, your girl had what she had to do. She had to bleach the knots. She had to use some purple shampoo to make sure that the knots were acceptable and not brassy. And yeah, so it's a nice thinned out hairline, natural clean hairline. So I didn't have to plug anything. The only thing that I did was allow it to air dry. I did uh, hot comb the perimeter just so that way the lace could lay down, baby. And then I put some curls in her, okay? So I will definitely show you that part of the video, okay? But when I did put the curls in, I did use some of my flexi rods and then I put a net on her so that the hair would feel like not droop, not fall, not, you know, lose its body, 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 you know, all that good stuff, honey. And sometimes I don't even put any type of curling rods or clips in it. I will put the clips in it, but then I will take them out and just pull the hair up with the actual um net you know what i'm saying so that way the curls don't dry why is this net stuff on here so that's like one of my little tricks and stuff so we gonna just see how it comes out i hope that the curls like held we, we just gonna see right now but i'm gonna show y'all one curl and then the rest you know i'm gonna take out on my own curl okay girl okay girl they look like the curls is looking promising too i didn't want to keep the clips in because i didn't want any type of dents in the hair and plus i didn't want the curls too tight so they did, they did come out nice and refreshing baby let me take the rest of these out and while i do that y'all can just you know check out how my crown wigs will send you your wig Okay, for friend. Mm. I long for that feeling. What did it have to go away? I long for that feeling. Remember everything you say. Had to go on. 
All right, you guys, so this actually did come together really nice. So I did have to recurl it. That was the only downfall about the unit was the fact that my curls didn't come out in the direction that I wanted them to go. Plus the top part right here, I decided to flip it over to give it more volume only because it felt like it was just trying to swoop downwards and like just take over the front of my face. And it wasn't in like a sexy swoopage. It was just like, it looked like the rain had fall on my head swoopage. It wasn't like the type of fall that I was going for. So I did decide to just, you know, move it over to the opposite side. This lace is definitely like lace and baby. It's like some nice lace. This hairline is great. Like if you want to pre-pluck it, you can, but it's already thin. So girl, don't overdo it. Okay. But as far as the volume and density, so I did um, cut this layer into the unit only because I wanted it to be, <clears throat> excuse me, I wanted it to be a little bit more full. I do like my wigs to be a lot more fuller because you know, like what I be telling y'all, if you're going to wear a wig, girl, you might as well do it big. Like I need like some volume and density, but this is cool for like an everyday wear. You know, a lot of people don't like their hair to be too voluminous, but I do. Okay, I do. But if you want to wear something every day, you want to fit in and blend in and be average, then I guess this volume, this density would de definitely suit you. The hair is very soft, for one. The hair is very soft. The lace is definitely melted, okay? The lace is actually really, really nice. And I think I did a damn good job with the bleach and the knot, girl. Okay, like, I came through. Yes, I did. I came through. This is a really cute unit. You could put this up if you wanted to. Girl, look, okay? This is cute. But you're definitely going to need some hairspray because, look, if you are one who like good volume then go for it and volume it up and spray it up baby okay you know what what i would do because i hate when my caps like kind of like raise right here i put a bobby pin on the inside of the cap like right about here and i kind of like anchor it onto my braid so that way the cap will lay flat you know you gotta do stuff we as women are magical we have to we figure it out we're like macgyvers okay you give us a q-tip and a and a, and a, a q-tip and a bobby pin girl we're gonna get you out of there we're we gonna hook you up you might have a whole new style it don't matter but i'm just telling you you definitely have to make the wig yours and for me, I do like it, and I think I'm glad that I did put the part on the opposite side. Plus, I'm really glad that glad that I did cut some layers into it because it gave it some depth. It gave it a little bit of volume. I will be honest and say it didn't seem like it held the curl real well. You know, the, the flexi rod you'll definitely you need, but if you're gonna heat curl it, you're gonna have to allow the curl to sit for at least 30 minutes. You know what I'm saying? Get so if you have a lot of hair, girl, your head is going to definitely fit under this cap. Okay, I am feeling the softness of this unit, and I'm feeling the lace of it too. I am not disappointed with that it just like melts into your hair as I'm like twisting it. Some sides, girl. You can even pull out little hairs, make it look wispy and free. You know, like you just got caught in a nice windstorm. Look at that. Mm. Pull a little bit of those hairs down. Honey, you'll be set to go. Some really buttery soft hair, okay? This is this is really cute. This lace is really lacy. For a first time, honey, my crown wigs or my crown hair, girl, y'all did y'all thing. The lace came through, the sleekness came through, the fit is all that, and girl, I can't ever say nothing else bad about it because this is a good wig. Make sure you check the description box down below for my crown wig. I will let y'all know all of the deets in the description box. So, you guys, I hope you all have an amazing day. Hope you enjoyed this video. I will link everything down below. I love you all. I appreciate you all for taking the time to watch me and with that being said have a good evening